well, after so many years of trying new Call of Duties, I was finally decided not to try the next one in 2024. But they actually come with the new mechanics. You can sprint forward, backwards, sideways. You can jump around the corner just in the Matrix way or in Max Ping, if you guys remember the game. You can also lean in the corner. If you get very close to a corner and you ADS, the character is automatically leaning. Also, if you shoot it on a door, it's automatically open. So it really creates a very interesting environment to play. And the new mechanics is really very interesting. And it's kind of appealing to give it a go because it feels the next step forward for Call of Duty in the last five years or so, because they didn't improve after that moment. And they just changed here and there some graphics and mimics. And overall, it feels the same thing, the same old Call of Duty. But what do you think? Do you think the new mechanics, the new movement will call you in the game? I'll definitely give it a test for open beta. And then I will decide if the game worth it to be played, if it worth to be buy it again. Because always when I buy a new Call of Duty, I play one or two mounts. And then the skill based matchmaking, which was not mentioned into the presentation, probably they will not change anything about it. After two mounts, the game is unplayable. A lot of sweats. Everybody's playing meta guns, the meta movement. And I'm not sure if this new movement will actually make it more fun or will create more toxic plays and is actually going to be more annoying to be a player in this environment. They also bring in a new storyline, which looks very interesting, a new zombie mode. And all of this, it is created in a Black Ops way and vibes that the fan of Call of Duty actually loves, especially the Black Ops 4. And I'm actually looking forward to see if this game will actually be interesting to give it a go. I cannot believe I'm saying this, but I'm actually interested about the next Call of Duty this year, Black Ops 6. Well, let me your thoughts down below. What are you guys thinking? Is it going to be an interesting game? Are you hype about this new Call of Duty? What do you think is going to be the same classic multiplayer that is just going to be boring after one or two months? They also included a new system for the perks. So the gun is going to have attachments and perks. We also had perks before but now it feels like it's a new system plus you can actually customize the minimap I never like the position of minimap in call of duty games i kind of like the way it is in battlefield is a position and now you can customize your hud the way you like it you can position your minimap in whatever the corner you like on the screen and that is definitely a plus for me and in combination with the new consoles that is going to drop in this autumn playstation 5 pro and the new xbox probably will make the game more appealing because they're also using a new engine for the game if you guys think this is an interesting news don't forget to leave a like subscribe and i hope you're gonna have some more news about battlefield pretty soon call of duty black ops see you there